Hi and welcome to this video. Okay, this is the first of several videos I'm going to make, short videos showing you how to get started with your Smoothie World websites using Serif Web Plus. So, um, when you start up Web Plus for the first time, you should see a screen like the one we've got in front of us now. If you don't see it, so if it just comes up looking like a blank document, go to File and then Start Up Assistant and you'll have that box. <clears throat> now, we want to start a new site, so we're going to click on the New Site button. And you need to give your site a name, so Smoothie World, or whatever you've called your site. For the URL, you can make this up, because we're not actually going to put it online, but I'll put smoothieworld.com. Um, in this box, you can choose a colour scheme for your site. I suggest you just choose whichever one is most closely uh, matching whatever you have in mind for your site. So if you think you want pinks or purples or blues or greens, uh, I think I'm going to go with Highlands. Um, but you could choose whatever you like for yours. Make sure that the page size is set to desktop. And then initial number of pages will probably be four, five or six depending on your site plans. So you need to have a home page, um, an about us page, probably something to do with locations, a page where your wraps and your smoothies are going to be listed out, something about the five a day and the benefits of doing those. So probably five pages is probably right for most people. We want to add a navigation bar and we want to save the site while we're doing it. So fill that out, put a name, site URL, choose a colour scheme, we can tweak that later, choose a page size of desktop, set the initial number of pages as appropriate for your site plan, Make sure those boxes are ticked and press start new site. Okay, and you'll be asked where you want to save your work. So you should have a computing folder. Uh, if you haven't got one, you can create one. And then a Smoothie World folder. If you don't have one of those as well, again, you can go to new folder and you can create a folder, go into Smoothie World and I actually happen to have a site called Smoothie World already, so I'm going to save over that. But if you didn't, or let's say we're going to call it something else, Cool Ices, um, save. Okay, so that's how you set up and get started with your first, uh, sort of how you set up and get started with Smoothie World.